Yeah, journalism is, I mean, you've seen how it's gone through such a dramatic change in the past 20 years. Um, and it sort of began, you know, with the dawning of the internet and these newspapers feeling like they had to put it all up online. And they put it up online for free because they wanted to mm -hmm. draw people in there in the beginning. And then people began to expect that. Sort of like with music <laughs> now, everyone just expects to get music essentially for free. Um, and you know, even now, iTunes is looking expensive by most standards. Um, so I don't know. Now with the newspapers, because people expect that, uh, the New York Times. I mean, everyone sort of follows the New York Times because they are essentially the national newspaper. Um, they put up the paywall. I don't know if you're familiar with that. It's where you get ten articles a month, mm -hmm. and if you go beyond that, you know, it costs you have a little subscription. Um, and so many other newspapers sort of followed suit with that. Um, the problem is then people can look, you look at the Star Tribune, you get 10 articles, you look at New York Times, you get 10 articles, Washington Post, LA Times, and there's so many different news sources out there that people don't necessarily subscribe.